Hi everyone, this is another video about the fabulous application called Papers and this uh, software is now up to uh, version 2.4.6 and I've been using it for about three years and it's the main way that I keep my PDFs for research organized. Um, there are a couple of uh, features that I really enjoy uh, one of which is the smart collections and you can see I've got several of these down the left hand side of the screen these are very much like the smart collections that you can set up or the smart playlists that you can set up in iTunes. For example, here I've um, asked papers to pull out all of the uh, manuscripts that have the word aneurysm uh, anywhere within them. Here, uh, another collection of papers that I've given five stars to. Here, papers that deal with the single word choline, uh, which is a research interest of mine. And I can show you by double clicking exactly how I set up these uh, smart collections. Uh, you give it a name, uh, for example, Colleen, and then simply you uh, can change any of these attributes to reflect exactly what you're looking for. So in this case, I'm looking for a paper uh, whose title uh, contains, and then you put in your phrase of interest. And you can limit it to those, pa those papers that have been recently published if you want to. Similarly for calcification, exactly the same thing. The title contains uh, calcification. Here I've used a wildcard indicator with the asterisk so that the uh, smart collection will also pick up um, titles like calcium and calcification. Um, so you can use a wildcard to substitute for both of those. Overall, smart collections are a really uh, good way of organizing your research documentation and I use them all the time. 